what is heat sink and concept of thermal runaway heat sink the transistor that handle large powers dissipates more heat during operation this heat if not dissipated properly could damage the transistor hence the power transistors are generally mounted on large metal cases to provide a larger area to get the heat radiated that is generated during its operation the metal sheet that helps to dissipate the additional heat from the transistor is known as the heat sink the ability of a heat sink depends on its material volume area shape contact between case and sink and the movement of air around the sink the heat sink is selected after considering all these factors the image shows a power transistor with a heat sink a tiny transistor as in the image is fixed to a large metal sheet in order to dissipate its heat so that the transistor doesn't get damaged thermal runaway the use of heat sink avoids the problem of thermal runaway it is a situation where an increase in temperature leads to the condition that further increase in temperature leads to the destruction of the device itself this is a kind of uncontrollable positive feedback we know that in a transistor power is dissipated in the collector and hence it is made physically larger than the emitter and base region as the power is dissipated there is a chance for the collector base junction temperature to be raised as the temperature at collector base junction increases the reverse leakage current icbo increases this is because icbo arises due to the flow of minority carriers which are thermally generated across reverse biased collector base junction as the temperature increases thermal generation increases icbo increases ic equals to alpha ie plus icbo so as icbo increases ic increases power dissipated is equal to i square into r so as collector current increases power dissipated increases which in turn increases the collector base junction temperature so the process is cumulative leading eventually to the destruction of the transistor thermal runaway can be prevented by using a simple heat sink